Hi, my name is Daniel Ayo. I'm 24 years old and I'm an SFL member from Vienna. Currently, I'm the head of design for a young ministry in Austria. My journey as an SFL began during my most challenging phase. Four years ago, I started my studies in the UK all by myself, and I encountered so many hardships. I was never able to pay for my accommodation on time, and I remember the day they slipped an eviction letter under my door. That was a really hard time for me because my family went through a lot of struggles, including financial instability, and I questioned what I was doing here in England in the first place. Why did I take that leap of faith? So by far the biggest challenge I was facing was the battle for my faith. I had a hard time expressing myself spiritually, and it didn't help that I was surrounded by people who didn't care about religion or who were not fond of the Catholic faith. To be honest, I also fell into a worldly state. Many times, I neglected my spirituality and chose to go out, party, and have the time of my life. Many times, when I had a shift on a Sunday, I just accepted it, instead of longing to celebrate Mass. And there were so many times I was completely content with that lifestyle. I kind of lost my own personality trying to fit in, changed my character, to gain more points for my CV and sacrifice my spirituality for all of that. It is hard. It is so hard trying to stand by yourself, especially when you just came from an environment where your community is really big, like it is in Vienna or Metro Manila. We are always told to go out of our comfort zone, not to be afraid, but to be bold. So even though I experienced many struggles, I am so very grateful to the Lord that He made me go through these hardships and gave me the gift of community through SFL. Without them, I would not have been able to grow in ways unimaginable to me. Without them, I would not have been able to see my personal limits without realizing the limitless love of God. Without them, I would not be where I am now. I reached a point where I realized I'm not complete and don't feel the worth in me. But the Lord always finds me and pulls me back to Him. He still allows me to care for others. He still gives me a chance to serve Him. He still shows me true love. No matter where I am, no matter how far I go, I know now, as long as I keep striving for better, there is greatness growing in me. My name is Danielle Ayo. I'm a servant that faces so many draining challenges in life. A servant that experienced a life out of comfort. A servant that was so close to giving up. But the love of my God is so strong. It never fails to reach me and to remind me that greatness awaits me.